living on Fox 14 continues. Today's Cooking with Olivia, sponsored by Max Fresh Market. And back to school is right around the corner, and Olivia is here with a great idea for lunches for your kids. So hey y'all, and welcome back to Cooking with Olivia. I am super excited for today because y'all know it is the first day of August, and as we are getting on to the month of August, you know it's back to school and everything. Our leader got to get up mm -hmm. you know, in the morning <laughs> and back to school, school supplies, all this stuff. So anyway, I know a lot of you moms stress out a lot because you got to get to work, and some of your kids you have to pack their lunches and stuff. Well, I have a very easy tip and recipe that I want to share with you moms out there. Something really easy you can cook the night before, and then all you, and all you gotta do is just put it in your kids' lunchbox and ready to go. It is stressful. Yeah. Yes, it lunches. really is. I understand because my mom is that. I mean, my mom's the same way. She gets stressful a lot around the school. <laughs> but anyway, so I'm going to show you how to make it. So, it, so today we are going to be making sandwich roly polies. So instead of just like the sandwich, like like the big sandwiches and stuff, these are cut down into smaller pieces, and your kids will enjoy them. And this one, and uh, you can also add some things to them, and also. It's something really easy your kids would love and very healthy too, so don't worry. So anyway, you want to start off with your tortilla and you want to get like a, like a 10 inch tortilla. Mm -hmm. And if you don't have your uh, flatbread, um, I can't remember what it's called. The the flatbread or pita pockets? Pita bread? Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, I can't remember. It's kind of a hard, but anyway. So you kind of want to cut it into a square. It, it comes in a round, and then you want to cut each side until you get it into a square. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to add some mayonnaise on here. So we'll start with your tea, and we're just going to add some mayonnaise on here. Not that much because it spreads really easy. And we're going to get our spatula, and then we are going to just spread this all on here. Just coat the whole tortilla mm -hmm. with the mayonnaise. Like this. Very nice. You got yes. it spread very neatly. Yes. So then after that, we're going to add in two slices of cheese. And two slices. And that's American cheese? Yes, American cheese. And if you want to spice it up a little bit, you can add some jalapeno cheese. I like that you can make this the night before, too. Yes, I know. And because it, cause it needs to be refrigerated, too. And all you have to do is just pop it oh. like, in a container or something. And it's ready to go. And if they kind of have an excess, you can just get a knife and just uh, cut this off. Mm -hmm. And do it like this. Just kind of cut that off. Watch your little fingers. <laughs> all right. Then uh, we just perfect. Cut, you did that perfectly. Cut that off like that. After that, we're going to add in two slices of meat on each side of the cheese. What like, kind of meat do you like the best? Oh, I like the, um, the, um, oh, wait a minute, what's it called? That's okay. I, I shouldn't have asked you. You're trying oh, to do your recipe. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> so then we're going to add some, uh, no, I, I think I like the turkey breast. Okay. The turkey yeah. breast meat. So we're just going to add, off. yeah, so we're just going to add some lettuce on here. Just kind of add so. And then we're going to add in two slices of tomatoes. And this is the, where the part gets a little tricky, depending on how you can do it. So we're just going to turn this around. Well, I like your cutting board. Yes. I'm going to eat one while you're cutting that. Yes. And then I'm just, then what I'm going to do is make sure you, now look how beautiful this looks. And then we're just going to very, 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 very tightly roll this. You need this packed in tight. Okay. So pinch and roll. Pinch Good. and roll and just really, really mm -hmm. pack and type this. And we're just going to kind of let it sit there just a couple minutes on that side. And this is where we're going to get our knife. And you want me to hold it or you got it? No, I got it. And then you're going to do like one inch mm -hmm. of a uh, away. And if it does mess up a little, you can add a little bit of mayonnaise on that and just stick it together. Oh, okay. So that's another tip. And then. <laughs> It gets a little messy and stuff, but Those there you so go. Cute. I know. And look at your little, little pretty little setup here and pretty trays. Yes. And my my children don't like a whole lot of bread. Yeah. And so, so this is perfect because the tortilla it's not too bready. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, that's not, a word. That, bready. Yeah. You know what I mean? Uh huh. <laughs> yes. Well, that is a wonderful I idea. And pack it with some chips yeah, and then a drink, and, and it's you're perfect. Set to go. Do you want one? Yeah. Let's try. Mm. All right. Okay, so when do you start school? Uh, August 13th. I'm kind of a little crazy on waking up in the morning. No, kind of morning. be a right, uh, <laughs> rude awakening. Hit the so, books. <laughs> yeah, just like up that, up that early well, every morning. Yeah, well, this will make it easier. These are really good. Yeah, Thanks, Olivia. It's great welcome. to have you. 
We'll be right back. Today's Cooking with Olivia, sponsored by Max Fresh Market.